Hey guys and welcome to the portrait of Belle Delphine. Before we actually start the video, make sure to wait until the end of the video and uh, yeah, there's going to be a massive giveaway and you don't want to miss it. See you there. Um, so we start off by simply drawing the shape of her head and making some rough outlines of her facial features. Um, this portrait of Belle Delphine uh, is quite a quite a good one. Uh, we see tiny subtle movements when doing the eyebrows in order to give it well defined and detailed uh, look without going over the top. Um, moving on to the mouth, uh, the mouth is actually quite a quite a weird one to draw. Um, her tongue is quite quite a weird shape. Um, quite weird indeed. The uh, the ears were quite unnaturalistic and they weren't quite hard to draw. Uh, two straight lines, two semi-circular lines, uh, two curved lines to fill it in. Um, the eyebrows were alright to draw I guess. The hair, uh, moving on to the hair. Um, the hair is quite nice. Um, I definitely do like it. Uh, we're using a range of shading and textural techniques to really bring the piece to life. Um, we can r really see the, uh, the realism uh, built into this, into this delicate and ever so, ever so lovely portrait of Belle Delphine. Um, so, what is there behind this portrait? Um, let's talk about emotions. Let's talk about what Belle Delphine may be feeling in this uh, present moment in time. We've really snapshotted a good, good representation of what Belle Delphine as a character, um, what what she's like, and what her what her motives and where the energy comes from. Um, we see her to be quite a quirky character um, and I've really managed to hit the nail on the head with the uh, quirkiness by simply capturing all the emotions and all the ever so detailed, um, ever so detailed, yeah, um, <laughs> um, so what I've, uh, what I've also managed to do was, uh, make a clear and concise, uh, contrast between the two eyes, um, her left eye is extremely detailed, uh, f full of life and emotion however her right eye is just a basic outline of an eye now what am i really trying to suggest when when drawing the two eyes like that so the real meaning i'm trying to bring behind this uh, this portrait is she makes herself to be a character a char character 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 caricature caricature of an anime character and what is she hiding she is not simply just an anime character in real life she's not simply just a gamer girl she's much more than that and i'm sure she's hiding loads of secrets behind it so in, so as you can see like the left and right side of her face is quite different and one of her main features well, 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 well one of the features in this uh in this portrait i'm trying to trying to do is um is the real differentiation of the two different sides of uh, belle delphine we can see her being being an anime character and we can also see her being a normal human the naturalistic look of the eye suggests she is human she's not just a ordinary um anime character 
Uh, so what else? What else can we see? We can truly see the uh, the amount of effort that has truly gone into making this wonderful portrait, and the inspiration I took from Gustave Coubert and his wonderful piece, The Clairvoyant, was reflected and can be seen in this uh, in this beautiful piece of art. So let's move on to the montage. It's giveaway time, lads. If you want to win this uh, lovely little picture of, uh, well, portrait, sorry, of Belle Delphine, um, all you have to do is leave a like on this video, make sure to subscribe, and also comment down below. Um, I will be announcing the winner on my Instagram, at dkeese, and um, yeah, have a wonderful night, and I shall look forward to giving this away. See you in a bit, lads. Cheers.